Hi, it's Bruce again in the Colorado Rocky Mountain Lab, and uh, right now what we're looking at is a Sencore TR139 in or out of circuit transistor tester. Um, it'll test transistors and diodes both in and out of circuit, uh, which makes it very easy uh, when you're trying to service a unit. And if you can measure out of circuit, then you can you can match transistors and diodes and so on because you have access to uh, exact beta values. The unit is very it's in very nice condition as you can see. Very large, easy to read meter. Um, it's nice, uh, clean. Very few nicks, scratches of any type. And let's turn it around here. It's the back. And we have a manual for it. So uh, you can learn all about how to use it, and uh, although it's fairly simple. Right now, I've got it connected to a, um, oh, a 2N3055. It's an NPN power transistor. Just happened to grab one out of the box. And uh, since I, I know it's NPN, I've, I've selected that. I looked up the, uh, the diagram for the connection points, so the, the base, the emitter, and then the collector. I know what they are. You'll notice that the red is the collector, the yellow is the base, and the black is the emitter. Um, we've got color codes on the unit and color-coded wires that run out, so you can kind of get used to that. Then you set the uh, your unit in, um, uh, depending on the transistor you're working with, either the low or high beta range. Uh, right now I'm going to go low. And you adjust the calibration point uh, till you get on the on the calibration line here and then you push the button and you read the gain of the transistor so we're getting a gain of roughly maybe 70 and then if we want to check to see if the uh, transistor has a leakage problem we put it to leakage for ICBO and we see that we're reading zero microamps or they're about so there isn't any leakage. And we're done testing that particular transistor. Really easy. Um, unit like this can run anywhere up to a couple of hundred dollars. Um, I think you're going to find that my price is very reasonable. And uh, it's it runs on AC power, 120 volts. Um, cord wraps around the uh, little loop in the back so you have for easy storage got a nice handle uh, basically that's it so uh, happy bidding and we'll see you again bye